everybody. Welcome back to Sibelius 7 Lessons here at Educator.com. Entering Chords. This chapter is an addition to previous unit note entry. We will talk about how we can create harmonic note entry using our computer keyboard as well as the MIDI keyboard. We will also talk about how to enter toplets and guitar taps in our score. Let's talk about the tab key first. The tab key is where we select what we see at the top of our score view. So at this point, I'm at the beginning of the score. And if I key in tab, I'm right at the top there. And on the content, there is a whole note rest is selected. If I keep on pressing the tab, just like any other application, I will go to the next bar. If it's more than, uh, if it's a smaller content in a bar, I will just like go over those, just like the 8 or 16 note value. And the way the tab works backwards is the shift tab. Hold down the modifier key, shift, and go back. So that's one way to do it. And another thing, if you see, uh, that's one way to move around. Basically, if I see bar 17 at the top of my score view, I tap to the 17th bar, basically. Let's escape that out. Scroll up. Uh, give a couple of uh, editing tips. If I go and select a note right here on the bar 9 and say half note C, as you know, with the arrows, I can go diatonically up or with the down arrow, I can go below, basically, with the, uh, with the diatonic intervals, with all the scalar notes. If I use my modifier key command and apply the same thing, up and down commands right now, moving my note up or down an octave. So command arrows will uh, we something else we covered before. I'm pretty sure, but that's how we go up and down an octave with the up and down arrows. Enter key will toggle on and off the tie. So if I select a note with the tie with the enter key, I can toggle on and off. And return key will basically change the notes with the accidentals to their harmonic equivalent. So basically what happens here, look at my first chord here, I have C, E natural and B natural. If I press on return key on Mac and, and enter key on uh, PC system, it will give me a harmonic equivalent. So instead of a C, I have here B sharp, instead of E, I have an F flat and instead of the B natural, I have a C flat. So return will toggle on and off. Let's escape this thing out and talk about simple chord entry by the mouse. You can simply enter the notes following up with their shadow notes by your mouse to create chords. It's pretty simple. Let's start with the tab. Let's enter the C command. First of all, let's make this one a whole note that we would like to do it. I'm going to start from the beginning and six to select and C. Um, we down arrow, command down arrow to have the middle C. And from here, basically, you see my mouse is loaded here, then I can go, let's say, to create a basic major triad. I just key in the notes, the octave. That's one way to do it. D, F, A, D, so minor triad, D minor triad, and so forth. So this is pretty easy. Um, 